Hello. <laughs> I'm. St I have a nice little setup here for playing music, and 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 um, I was just kind of practicing a little bit, but I wanted to, I wanted to record a little something for everybody in um, this um, this group. And thank you to Byron for inviting me. Uh, great dude, uh, really is. I mean, we've never met personally, but what an amazing father and and just a a, a great guy overall. So thanks for letting me. Uh, join hopefully it's okay if i post this you can take it down if i'm not supposed to i don't know how it's, i don't know how it works but man if if you're like me you've 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 kind of had it and not just over the last couple of years but over the last bunch of years where you it seems like we're not allowed to talk to each other um when i say we look i don't pull punches that's that's for children pulling punches is for children i know the vast majority of the people in this group are black and i'm white obviously um you know my dad but it, i'm white for 2020 now when i moved into my hometown in Kearney in 69 it was my mom's spanish she's hispanic and my father's italian believe me when i tell you in 1970 where i grew up a few miles from times square in new york city if you're italian or hispanic you're not white <laughs> okay it's a different time now uh, okay but that's all right so man <laughs> I just I want to learn and I want to talk to people and I'm I have a heart to love others and that's sincere if you go back and check my timeline which you're more than welcome to or if you have any questions please just ask me I'll tell you I got nothing to hide um, but I just wanted to get an opinion um, from everybody about what you think about the news media now you may like it you may hate it I don't know it's up to you and I'm not I'm not Whatever side of the fence you fall on politically is the side you fall on. There used to be a time, way back in the day, where it didn't matter all that much. Because I remember growing up as a kid in the 80s, um, playing music for a living by that time. You'd, um, you know, I went to an old man's bar every Monday or Tuesday, depending on the day. It's called Grams. Um, because I played music. I was either teaching music or doing marching band or drum corps Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So if I want to go hang out, I don't want to hang out in, in a place that has like loud music, you know. So it was this old man's bar that I ended up hanging out for for the better part of 15 years, and or 10 years, and <clears throat> and you know there was all it was pretty diverse, you know, a lot of white dudes, but you know you'd have whatever in there, and you know we'd get into these pretty intense political arguments, and I mean it would get loud, it would get fucking loud. <laughs> people would get pissed off but then you know it would calm down a little bit after a couple of fuck yous and whatever and then a few seconds later it'd be like whose turn is it to buy you know you can't do that anymore and I'm of the opinion my personal opinion you may disagree my personal opinion is that the media is playing a huge part in this I think that they they rip us apart when I say us I mean race I mean politically I mean, gender-wise, I mean, whatever division they can find to slice us up, they do it. You may disagree. I, that's fine. I, I <laughs> disagree all you want, I, you know, because at the end of the day, if you can't talk to somebody to find out what they're thinking, then you don't learn nothing. And I think there's a force at work here that doesn't want anybody to talk to each other. They just want to tell everybody what the fuck to do, and then we're supposed to just jump in line and do it. And I have some really intense feelings about um, where we're at politically and stuff. And I don't want to throw 10 million things because it's, I don't know if I'm supposed to be. <laughs> I think it's okay if I do this, but I don't want to get anybody pissed off at me. Um, so I was just curious, and I can't type this out. It's too big and it's too long, and I want to get to know people, and I want them to get to know me. So I was just curious what you all think about that. I'm very concerned about the media. Because I don't think, it's not about political differences anymore and then going home and saying, all right, fuck it, your team won, my team lost, vice versa, whatever. I think it's about your team's evil. That's what they're trying to make it, in, they've turned it into. Your team is evil and my team isn't. And <clears throat> the thing that finally got me to want to start making audio tapes about this, you all remember tapes? <laughs> I do, I'm old. I turned 56 pretty soon. Um, I don't even remember. 
We can't talk to each other no more. Why? When did that happen? I don't, I don't know if I'm right about anything or wrong about anything. I do know the only way to figure that out, though, is to talk to you, whoever you are, as opposed to listening to the fucking overlords telling us how to think and what to do. When did that happen? When did it happen when we were taught, we're not, now we're being taught what to think as opposed to how to think, you know? So I'm just curious what you all think about the news media and where you're at with it. Nothing but love for everybody. Hopefully I get to know some people. Um, it would be an honor to do that. Thank you. And I uh, hope you have a good night and God bless.